I've been able to watch history these last eight years as I've lived here and to be actively involved in it. Fifty million people are free from tyranny because of the United States and because of my husband's policies. Girls were forbidden an education in Afghanistan until the United States liberated Afghanistan. These are very, very important uh, world-changing happenings and they're for the best. Or the same thing in Iraq. I mean, do people really wish Saddam Hussein were still there? I don't think so. And I think it's very, very important for uh, the people of the United States to continue to support the people in Afghanistan and Iraq. The First Lady has a podium that is special. I've had the opportunity to be an ambassador for our country all over the world and to um, also talk about issues that have always been important to me. So I've been to Africa five times to talk about AIDS and the President's Malaria Initiative. I've had the chance to uh, go to Afghanistan three times. Uh, that's something that I've been proud to do. The women of Afghanistan have a very special place in my heart. Well, George is going to develop a Freedom Institute, a policy institute, at the Presidential Library in Dallas. And I think I'm going to be able to use that institute as a vehicle to continue to work on issues that have to do with freedom from tyranny, like women in Afghanistan or Burma, but also freedom from poverty, uh, freedom from illiteracy. So there's going to be a really great way, I think, for me to uh, keep working on all the issues that have been important to me. Well, I haven't given her advice, really, but I've Obviously, I've told her that this is a home. I know that's her first um, priority right now is to make it a home for her little girl. She were, Sasha is the age that Barbara and Jenna were when they first came to the White House in 1989 when their grandfather was inaugurated. And I, I can see the White House through their eyes. I remember what it was like. And so I know that that's what she's interested in, and that's what I've talked about with her the most.